A boy is back with his mom and his father who kidnapped him, ordered to go to prison. This was a custody case that crossed international borders involving a man who assaulted his wife to get his hands on their three-year-old. 7 News reporter Tyler Lopez shows us this whole ordeal has left a family hurting. Monty Turner was an offender. He was an offender that was looking for a victim. From inside the courtroom, Monty Turner appears sorry, but he chooses not to speak about kidnapping his own son, three-year-old Luke Turner, twice. He loves his father and he misses him, but he's also very angry at him. May 25th of last year, Monty Turner was already under investigation for allegedly kidnapping Luke over the Independence Day holiday 2012. Longmont police would find the boy in Akron, Colorado, hidden in a parked truck. By this scene at DIA, the child had been taken again. His mom hit with a taser and pepper spray. Police grabbing Monty and his son in Manitoba, Canada the next day. He goes back and forth between being angry and wishing he could see him. And that's, that's going to be hard on him for for a very long time. Brandy is now the fourth ex, Mrs. Turner. Prosecutors say he saw them all as perfectly trusting. I can't feel good about somebody going to prison for a very long time. You can't feel good about that, especially somebody that you loved. And I, I, to be honest, I still love him. There's a part of me that will always love who he pretended to be. I have never seen anything like this in the 17 years that I've been a prosecutor. But at the same time, this falls within that pattern of domestic violence and domestic abuse that we see in day in and day out. Monty Turner avoids trial, but he agrees to serve 75% of that 36 years. A prosecutor telling me he'll have to be released after 24 years, but she believes he'll serve at least 20 behind bars. In Boulder, Tyler Lopez, 7 News.